We're going to show you how you can airplay from your Apple device to your Roku streaming player or smart TV. This is a streamable first look. What's up streamers, it's Jason from The Streamable and we're gonna show you exactly how you can airplay from your iPhone, iPad, and Mac directly to your Roku streaming player or Roku TV. But before we get going, make sure you hit that subscribe button because we're bringing you the best in streaming tips and reviews of the latest streaming gadgets and services like T-Vision, the new Fire Stick, the new Google Chromecast, and the new Air TV Anywhere. So for those of you who don't know what AirPlay is, AirPlay allows you to take your video and music and easily get it onto your streaming player by just hitting a few buttons on your phone. It's kind of similar to the way you can cast things to a Google Chromecast. And while it's been available on Apple TV and recently came to smart TVs, this is the first time that it's available on Roku devices. And why this is important is it opens up the ability to stream apps that might not have channels already on Roku. For instance, you can airplay HBO Max and Twitch even though there aren't channels channels directly available on Roku. So who can actually do it? Well, Roku has made it available to all of their 4K streaming players. So that means their Roku Premiere, Roku Streaming Stick, Roku Streaming Stick Plus, Roku Ultra, and their audio product, the Roku Smart Soundbar and their Roku Stream Bar. It will also work on all of their Roku TVs. So whether you have a streaming player or a smart TV from Roku, you'll be covered. So now we're going to show you how you can set it up so you can start airplaying your favorite apps. Hey everybody, Tyler here. So first you're going to want to go into settings and then down to Apple Airplay and HomeKit. You're going to have to wait for it to load and load and load, and then you'll get a pop-up with your Airplay passcode. Then you'll want to go over to your iPhone and hit the Airplay widget in the control center. You'll see your Roku device and you can hit that to enter the Airplay passcode from your TV. After that, you can head over to your streaming service app of choice, in this case HBO Max, and pick the show you want to watch, pick the episode, and just hit play and it'll start playing on your Roku. Another way to do it is if you're already watching something on your phone, iPad, or even your Mac, you can hit the AirPlay button and it'll bring up the same control center menu from before. Just choose your Roku from the list of speakers and TVs, and there you go. There are also a few settings in the AirPlay menu on Roku that you should know about, including the require code option, where you can set it to require a code only once, every time you try to AirPlay, or use a separate password instead that you can set up manually. Here you can also set up subtitles and captioning fonts and font sizes, and you can also set it up with HomeKit. For that, you're gonna to wanna to go down to HomeKit Setup, and if you take your phone out and open the camera app, you can take a picture of the QR code on your screen. Or if you like, you can also enter that eight digit HomeKit passcode into the Home app on your iPhone. This will allow you to turn your Roku on and off from the Home app and your control center. You can also set it up to turn on and off with your HomeKit scenes. And that's it, it's that simple. If you have any questions, make sure you drop it in the comments below. And if you found this video helpful, make sure you give us a like. And if you want videos just like these, make sure you hit subscribe. As always, visit us all week long at thestreamable.com. And for The Streamable, I'm Jason. Have a great week.